Over the years, players of Breath of the Wild have discovered unique and unintended ways to launch themselves. Today, I'll be teaching you how to do five of my favorites. Here we go! To pull off a bullet time bounce, you're first going to want to get some high ground on a basic enemy like a Bokoblin, Moblin, or Lizalfos. If it's not a red enemy, shoot an ice arrow right next to it to freeze it. Next, shield jump towards it, landing on top of it in bullet time. Now press Y to spin out in style. Congrats, you pulled off a bullet time bounce. Otherwise known as a box launch, this one is pretty basic. You'll need to find a wooden box, spawn out a bomb, and now place the bomb perfectly at the corner of the box. Now hop up onto the box and position yourself on the opposite corner. Once you're positioned correctly, detonate the bomb, and you'll be off. Now you've done a Kibako launch. The Wind Bomb, otherwise known as the Bomb Impact Launch, is arguably the most famous exploit in Breath of the Wild. Standing with a ledge in front of you, throw aim in the general direction that you want to go, then hold ZL, now jump forward quickly, placing Circle Bomb, and then tap ZR to go into bullet time. Now switch to Square Bomb, quickly placing it right behind you. Then switch back to Circle, detonating it, and knocking the Square Bomb into you. If you did it correctly, you pulled off a Wind Bomb. With a bit of practice, these can be pulled off quickly and with ease. By placing a cryonis block and the master cycle in shallow water, then positioning yourself on top of the cryonis block, you can set up for this glitch. Now make a cryonis under the master cycle, and when it's at mid height, jump perfectly on top of it and enter bullet time half a second before landing on the cycle. It will send you launching. There are a few variants of this, but my favorite is the Hinox launch. Ride your master cycle toward a sleeping Hinox, then jump perfectly onto the crease of his elbow. It will send you launching when he smacks you. This is the standard launch that any player would think of. Just use any stasisable object and knock it into Link to send him flying. I'm going to go over a more advanced variant known as a rocket launch. Rocket launches are commonly done with trees. For this launch, stasis it and angle it like normal, but instead of having Link in the line of the stasis, have him grab onto the object so that he goes flying along with it. 